Hello Zebraherd and welcome back to Dragon Ball Fighters. And today we are moving on with chapter three, map three, where we're attempting to save Krillin way on down here. But to do that, I guess we gotta go through a number of different situations. I figure we'll just try to get as much done as we possibly can. Cause why not? I mean, if I feel like it's gonna be easier for right now just because, you know, they're trying to get us used to the game. So maybe I can just sort of be a bit of a completionist with it. But the art of battle. Use dashes, backsteps, and Z combos to take down your opponent. Master these techniques and nothing can get in your way. So it looks like we're taking on evil clone Yamcha. We took on only Android 16 and clone Goku in the last episode, so I'm very interested in fighting a huge variety of enemies. But yeah, this game doesn't have a gigantic character roster like the other Dragon Ball games have. This one's more focused on having a smaller roster comparatively, it still has a pretty big roster, and making sure those characters all play uniquely and enjoyably. Okay, so distance yourself from the opponent by using a backstab. Cool, did it. And then, whoop. I got it, there we go, whoop. Oh, I'm on this side now. There we go, I fixed it. Perform a Z combo with consecutive heavy attacks. Rapid press circle. Okay. Uh, whoa, 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 pretty good. Okay, on to the now next one. one. The art of battle perform a light, medium, heavy Z combo. I didn't, that wasn't exactly what I wanted because there we go, right? Maybe not. Oh no, I did it. That was weird. I don't know if I, I understand that one. Oh, okay, so perform a light, medium, heavy Z combo and end with the key blast. Oh, uh, well, too late. Do I have to do the battle again? I think I need to do the battle again. Uh, well, that wasn't what I wanted. I wanted to learn more in the tutorial. Uh, well, I got a KO bonus, so that means I'm gonna gain some experience to my next level, which is pretty cool. Oh, maybe I should have chose the option to restart if I had it, but weird that the, the, the battle will just end even if you're not done the tutorial. And I can't do it again? I can't. Oh, man, that may be been a, be, gonna be a bit of a mistake. Okay. So I'll go this way. I have 18 turns, so I should be able to make the most of this pretty gosh darn well. If I go against Tien here, battles aren't all about attacking. You need to defend yourself too. Your opponent knows this and will block your attacks. You use Dragon Rush to break their guard. Okay, oh, and we're in the Cell Battle Arena, which is pretty cool. So it looks like the actual location of the area doesn't really matter too much, like in the storyline, I guess. There's just characters all over the place in different environments. But yeah, there's sort of this board it's sort of like Dragon Ball Budokai 2, but in that, it was almost a little bit like Mario Party, where you could find different items, you could actually just bump into somebody else, and that's how a battle would start. Okay, so, oh, okay, I see. So if we hold the back button, we can actually just block. All right, there we go. Got it. Also, Tien looks awesome, I love him. Okay, so, hold on. So let's guard against our opponent twice in a row if I can. If you could attack the end, that'd be great. Uh, whoa, Tien, like attack, please, ow. What are you waiting for, dude? Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, ooh. Come on, close the distance and attack, or something. Maybe I just gotta time it. No, no, come on, why is it so awkward? Just attack, dude, you have the, the biggest opening in the world. Goku's gonna let you hit him. No, come on, this is, am I really expected to have this passive reaction time in the very beginning of the game? Oh my, well, am I getting something wrong here? Like I know I, I'm posting, I, I'm supposed to press the opposite direction of him. But like, there we go. Okay, so, man, it's super tough. Guard against three of, of your opponent's attacks in a row. There we go, it's just he wasn't attacking. All right then, break your opponent's guard with Dragon Rush. All right, whoa Okay, so that's sort of like our grab move, I guess. Break your opponent's guard in the air by, okay, got it. All right, that was decent. Finished by defeating the enemy. Okay, well I'm a little low on health, so that might actually be a bit difficult, <laughs> but I'll do what I can. Um, I've been wanting to try some other moves. Maybe I could like, oh, here we go, I figured out how to do the super finish. <laughs> Maybe a little overkill for 4TN here, but he is the evil clone. So you know what, if I blast him off the face of the earth, <laughs> who cares? I just told the guy to go Super Saiyan 3 with that, but we got a destruction finish, which is pretty cool. Awesome, awesome stuff. We got an award, defense up level one. So how do I apply that? I'm not really sure. We got a bit more money. I can see who I defeated. Oh, that's it, okay. I was hoping there was gonna be an option to redo the battle for the things we missed, but I guess we can always go into the training for that. 
And of course, if you guys have any tips or advice, I would love to hear them because I will not be very good at this game, but I'm trying my best. So if we go to our player skills, we have none equipped right now, but do I have any now? I should have unlocked one. Yeah, we got defense level up. So that'll increase our defense. Do we have anything else then? Did we get anything for defeating Krillin? I don't think we did. I wish there was a way to organize this in order of what we have and what we don't have, but for now, move here and we have 16 turns, so we're gonna be able to make this work. Begin the battle with the Cologne Piccolo. Our Roared is an attack power up level one. Oh, that's exciting. Okay, so I do like this sort of like this skill situation as well. Now we're going against Cologne Piccolo. And oh my gosh, I love Piccolo so very much. Uh, yeah, it's, it's gonna be really cool. But yeah, if you guys don't know, the way I got introduced to Dragon Ball is through the fighting game Dragon Ball Ultimate Battle 22. So this one is a... Uh, it seems to be the same tutorial. Um, yeah. Wait, wait, okay. Well, we've learned some things about dashing. Well, let's see what else we got here. Yeah, so it looks like it's actually the same one as we missed before, so if I could, you know, just keep going. There we go, okay, so boom, boom, boom. There we go. And then, now what? There we go, that was good. That was a little bit different, I think. I don't know though. Okay, so now we can just defeat him. So that was the only thing we were missing. We learned what we needed to learn there. Boom, we're gonna get a bit of a destructive finish, I think. Mission complete. All right, cool. I love this map. I don't know why Piccolo is hanging out here. And well, we got a tag power up, level one. We're almost at level two for Goku. I don't know if that carries on to other levels or if that's just for this level. We'll have to figure out how all that works, of course, in time. But yeah, this game's actually pretty similar to Dragon Ball Ultimate Fighter 22 on the original PlayStation in the way that it's it's a smaller character roster and it's a 2D fighter with sort of, I guess, flat looking characters. This game actually does not have flat looking characters. But either way, we're gonna go face TN again and hopefully it's a tutorial we've already seen so we can just go crazy on him. Actually, it's against two people, Clone TN and Yamcha. This might actually be a bit more difficult than I was expecting, a 1v2 situation, but I'm okay with that. We're gonna do what we can. I'm excited. I am real gosh darn excited. It's all or nothing. Okay, it's all or nothing indeed. So I don't think there will be any tutorial for this one then, which is just fine with me. I just wanna play the game now. Ooh. I mean, it, does, it hasn't told us everything. I'm sure there's gonna be more tutorials. And I mean, this game isn't super crazy with the combos, which I actually prefer, because you know, like with Street Fighter, where I have to put in like a 50 button combo for all the best moves or whatever it's like. I don't really play those games enough to really say. I'm not really a big fan of that, of course, just because it can be quite difficult. He's volleying me right now. Get out of here, sir. Okay, so there's that. If I could charge up before we face Yamcha too much, I would be great. Um, Hold on. Wait, 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 ow. Oh boy. You know what, I might have to, yeah, just knock you back and then Try this out, going Super Saiyan 3 Goku. We did land that on you. You have 5,000 health, let's see how far we can knock that down. Ooh, he's down to like halfway, which is great. I know I'm still playing pretty awful, so like I'm not getting, you know, too out of, out of the, you know, zone of excitement. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Beyond, I'm having so much fun with this game though. It's been a blast so far. It's a lot of fun. Okay, so we got our victory there. We got a health recovery bonus level three. So obviously a higher reward what is with that? We were closer to level two before. Oh no, wait, I don't know. There's two bars here. There's a golden bar. Oh, that's his health. Oh, I'm a dingus. Okay, so I thought it was almost at a level up there before. It was actually just our health in that battle. Okay then, pretty good though. If we go and figure that out now, if we go to our edit team, I can uh, go to player skills and we can do attack up level one and defense up level one. So let me go ahead, attack up. No, 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 that's not what I wanted. Okay, so defense up. And then what else? I think we have one more now, right? No, we only have two out of 80. So that's all we got for right now, which is just fine. We can move over to the city here, which won't do anything. And then finally, take on uh, Clone Krillin. We get another attack up, attack power up level one. Krillin is now playable as a reward. Awesome. Charge your key and defeat your opponent with a flashy super attack. I'll, I'll try, that's what I've been trying recently. I mean, we did that with Tien. I, I might wanna check the combos and see what other super moves we have, because I'm pretty sure we have another one as well, like a teleport it's one. Krillin. Oh, it's Krillin, he ain't looking so good. Uh-oh, it's his clone, his clone beat clone? him up? Yes, it is. No, 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 don't do that. I've gotta save him. All right, go in, dude. Beat him up. Okay, so it's Goku versus Clone Krillin. 
<laughs> Is it really anybody's guess? It's Super Saiyan Goku versus Clone Krillin. Now, I know I pre-ordered the game right before it came out. Oh, he is level two, though, it said over his name. Um, so I did pre-order the game, so I should be getting the Super, Sa Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku and Vegeta, as well as just the normal ones. Okay, so, oh, okay, I see. So one thing is to keep in mind, like we have moves like that, we have to do the opposite of that if we're facing the other opposite side of the character, which is actually quite difficult to remember. It's always towards your character, so here it would be up and right, but if I was facing the other direction, it'd be up and left. All right, then. So perform a special move, whoa! That was cool. All right then, perform a super attack. Um, oh, I don't have one key gauge, so it's not gonna work correctly. Um, oh, and I'm also doing it the opposite direction once again. Ooh, here's our normal Kamehameha. All right, and then a meteor attack. Consumes three key gauges, so let me go ahead and... Nice, so meteor attack seems to be our awesome special move. Finished by defeating the enemy, okay. Um, let me charge up then all the way up to three, then why do we get so much? We get up to six, seven, holy cow. Can I do more? Um, no I can't, okay. Well now I know. And then I'm gonna, there we go, go Super Saiyan 3, hit you in the back, hit you with the Super Ultra Kamehameha to take care of Krillin, cause that is necessary for such a threat. Oh, this did this one do the exploding the planet? It didn't, why not? Weird, either way, Krillin is now playable. Awesome stuff, we're getting closer and closer to uh, level two, but we don't have to worry about it quite yet. Okay, so we battle with Krillin, we're learning how to use more moves. Pretty good, right? Oh, he's still knocked out. Oh, hey, he's okay. Usually you're the one with the sensu beans, so I don't know what to do for you. Hey there, Goku. <laughs> uh, say, where are we? Is this Bulma's airplane? Last thing I remember is investigating the origin of the clones. But then I got all dizzy. Let's see. Nah, it's no good. I can't recall anything after that. So did you save me, Goku? <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Goku. You never let me down. No need to thank me, it's nothing. After all, whenever I'm in a pinch, who's the guy who's always there to throw me a sensu bean? That's Krillin. Well, sometimes I think I'd rather be the one eating them, though. <laughs> so, who did this to me? I can't remember a thing. A lot's gone on, Krillin, and not much of it good. Where to begin? Yeah, it actually is a lot, you know. We're not actually Goku, it's really weird. Yeah, I never would have imagined. Look, I'm glad Android 16 is alive, but I just wish he wasn't our enemy. Anyway, I've decided. I want to help out, and I kind of want to find out what 16 was really up to. So I'm going to fight too, if that's okay with you, Goku. Sure, fine by me. You forgetting something? Haven't you guys, like, lost your power? Oh, yeah. Oh, has he? I guess it must have slipped my mind. So, what are we going to do about that? More training might restore some of my power, but I would still be in no state to fight by myself. Huh? Wait a minute, so does this mean I can't fight either? Maybe. I might just have an idea, but we need that soul inside Goku to agree. What do you say? Do you think you can move from Goku over to Krillin? <laughs> That's a huge assumption for me just to be able to do. What? So whatever's inside Goku is gonna link with me? Krillin, sure, why not? both of you, close your eyes and take a deep breath. She seems to be an odd expert about this. Okay, now it's your turn. Try moving to Krillin. I'll give it a shot. Oh, is that heartburn and digestion? Or is it me? Is this my symbolicness of being a player? Whoa. So are I you guess. Like out of my body now? There's a yep. stranger inside my body. It worked! Oh no. You changed who you're linked with! <laughs> now everybody can fight! But only so, one at a time. Does that mean when Krillin's out there fighting, I have to just wait on the sidelines and not do anything? If only one yep. link can exist at a time, then I guess so. But if we can get more people to join us, it'll relieve some of the strain on Goku. Well, Hopefully. we can't just rely on Goku all the time. Now can we? I guess we can't. I guess I don't mind. 
It's not like I was really doing the fighting myself anyway. Yeah, that's your favorite part. Some image training. That is until I get the chance to fight again. Only you would think of that, Goku. Anyway, <laughs> I guess we'll all have to work together from now on. Well, weren't we all already? I mean, I guess Goku usually takes the lead. All right, well, we can link to any character on our side, so now we can play as Krillin, which is exactly what we wanted. Interesting how they're explaining the idea that the player is playing as the characters. Recover health after each battle won. Characters who fought recover a little health, while fighters or while characters who rested recover a lot. If all of your character's health reaches zero, it's game over, so make sure to switch out fighters frequently to give everyone ample chance to rest. By gaining more allies, you can also prevent your pool fighters from running dry. It's not just Goku and the other fighters who have levels, enemies have them too, and their link levels also increase after each turn. But the silver lining is that the de defeating these power powered up enemies gets you more experience, and depending on the map you're on, a fearsome foe may emerge from the shadows. You have saved Krillin. Add this character to your team via the edit team accessible from the map screen and pause menu. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, choose a second character here and make it Krillin. He's level one, Goku's level one. Pretty good stuff overall. We do keep these, these skills, that's pretty good. Um, we're gonna use those, so I guess what that means is while it might be advantageous to use your strongest character all the time, it might also be good to save them until battles like these. Now, uh, Yamcha over here has a green thing next to him. Yam oh, wow, so if we do this, we can unlock Yamcha. But doesn't that also mean we can skip it? Weird. Um, so, ooh, we can go against Trunks. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, tutorial battle will be going against Clone Trunks and Clone Krillin. We'll be able to get assist fill rate up level one. You're not alone this time. Use Z assist and Z changes to call upon your allies and defeat your opponent. Fighting together as a team is the key to victory. All right, let us go. But now that the game has been out for a tiny bit as of this episode going out, I would love for you guys to let me know if you want to, uh, what are your thoughts on the game? I'd love to hear if you've been playing through the story mode or just playing online, this all that kind of cool stuff. From my clone. It's seriously like looking into a mirror. If other people saw this thing and didn't know any better, they definitely think it was me. Well, do you ever wear gray wonder. clothes? You think maybe 18 can tell the difference between me and my clone? I think Let's I'd hope be so. really upset if she couldn't. Uh, she, she probably could. <laughs> what am I talking about? This isn't the time for stuff like that sight of this guy now I'm in real trouble my days as a police officer would be over if it committed any crimes looking like me which means that's true <laughs> better get rid of this guy before bad things start happening okie doke it'd be cool if they had Krillin in his like police outfit and in his normal outfits as well that'd be really cool so maybe that'll be something they do in the future I don't know but it is Goku Krillin versus clone trunks and clone Krillin oh clone trunks look so cool I can't wait. I mean, I haven't gone to the Trunks Saga, the Future Saga in Super yet, because it's not out in the English dub. I am so excited for it, it looks like a lot of fun. I'm tempted to watch the Japanese uh, dub, English subs, but... Okay, so yeah, let's go ahead and do Z Assist. Oh, he just charges in. Oh, no, no, I did the wrong button. I did back in L, maybe? There we go. Wait, no, use the Z Assist. Uh, there we go. That worked that time, he threw a Senso Bean. All right, perform a Z change, hold L1. Ah, we hold L1 to Z change. Perform a quick Z change. Okay, that's what I was getting confused about in the beta. All right then, so use a Dragon Rush. Um, That's not a Dragon Rush. Uh, All right, though, what did that, oh, oh, that forced him to change, that's right. Finished by defeating the enemy. Okay, so we figured it out. I will go ahead and play as Krillin then, just so we can get a bit of a, a variety in today's video. I would love to see his Z moves, because I don't remember them. I, I mean, of course, he probably has Destructor Disc. Oh, oh yeah, he has this move that he used to use on like the Cybermen and stuff. It's gonna break all over them. Crazy, crazy cool. But if I also check out my other move list, we have Solar Flare, which is really cool. That didn't do too much. Maybe I gotta be like really close to him. Wait. Oh yeah, it did. Very cool. We have Kamehameha, performable in air. We have the Sensu Beam. Um, okay. Oh, that, well, that'll heal me. Can I get myself back up to full? Um, oh, I don't have enough energy for that. Sorry, I'm just, I, like, while I have the chance, I wanna try things out. 
Um, why did that not do anything? Uh, like, some of them do, some of them don't. Either way, he also has destructor disc. Um, there it is, there it is! Ooh, that did not, I thought that was gonna be like his super awesome finisher move, I guess it isn't. Boom, got him. That should also knock him into a building. Very cool, but we're not quite done. We gotta take on Trunks now. So I'm gonna go ahead and Dragon Rush you if I can. Okay, maybe not. Oh boy. And then, there we go. And we're gonna beat you up still. We're not done, we're not done. I also wanna try, yeah, switching to Goku. Not because, you know, like I said, I wanna play as Krillin just to train up, but I also wanna try to figure this out in a little bit better. So, cause I can, oh, Kamehameha, that is cool. And then I can switch back to Krillin and he can finish him off. Krillin got the win, hooray. Mission completed. Okay, that's a lot of fun, switching between characters like that. And that's sort of the main meat of the gameplay, is typically doing stuff like that, but with three characters instead of two. Goku got level two there as well, which is really awesome. I don't really know what level ups do, besides, of course, just probably improving their statistics. So I'm sure overall it'll be nice and good. But uh, now we get to go into the uh, edit team button, because I'm gonna get my third and final player skill for now, which is going to be the player assist up. Uh, so I'm guessing that whenever we do Increases the rate at which the assist gauge fills. What is the assist gauge? I'm actually not familiar with that. Either way, I wanna probably move down here. It gives us a partial drain level one. I wanna be able to get as much as I can now while I have the turns remaining and the uh, you know powered up characters as much as I can. But we gotta fill back up the full there. I'm guessing with the levels going on, like we might not be able to get our characters filled up all the way. So we have to be careful. We need to be able to play as well as we can. I'm just sort of taking my time, of course, because there's a lot of tutorials to learn. This is when I want to sort of get it into my system rather than later. But I gotta say, I've been blown away by the art style. It really looks like, you know, Dragon Ball came to life in video game form. So this is, no, it's it's once again Z assists. It's, it's all the same tutorials. But that's fine with me because I get stuff for it. So I guess I could have sort of chose my tutorial, which is just fine. Um, but he's sort of being a little lenient for that. He sort of looks like Goku Black in this setup. I don't really know too much about Goku Black. Once again, he is in the arc that I haven't seen yet. I'm really tempted just to watch the English, or the English sub, it would be the Japanese voices, which this game starts with if you don't change it in the settings. Make sure you do that if you haven't played the game yourself yet. You don't wanna miss out on these, on these voices, they're great. Um, so let me go ahead and switch really quickly. Quick change like that, and then, ooh. Come on, come on, boom! Hit you with the special move, that's awesome! And then rain down on me, wow, that does so much damage! That was really cool! Battle completed, Krillin has a pretty cool move set. But that's sort of the thing that's so awesome about this game is that since every character has their own individual moves to them, each character can be worth playing in their own ways, and I know a lot of people have been saying Yamcha is actually one of the best characters in the game to play right now and is just beating everybody's butt. There's just a lot of really good Yamcha players. Speaking of which, if we go up to the next event, we can actually become Yamcha, but before we do that, I wanna go back to the player's skills and see what our other thing was. Partial Drain, recovers a portion of the damage done to enemies as health. Ooh, I actually like that. More than I like the assist gauge, which I don't really know what it does. Here we go, this is um, next battle. Uh, there's no information about it, but we do get Yamcha is a playable character if we win, it's a 2v2. We also get special attack power up level one if we succeed, so I'll try it. And then there's also Cell down there that I would love to go against. Like, there's so many awesome things going on. I'm super excited. But the longer we wait, the stronger they get. He seems to be okay. That's good. Goku, Krillin, did you come to rescue me? No, we came here to look and laugh. Yamcha, you weren't even knocked out. Yeah, well, I can speak but only just barely. Goku found me, I was out cold. You're actually in pretty good shape. Imagine that. You don't say. What happened to me anyway? Feels like I got hit by a truck. Where to begin? Huh? Oh boy, more clones. Well, this is probably what hit you. Crap, another clone's appeared. Krillin, save it for later. Let's deal with this guy first. Okay, so clone Yamcha, and I think clone trucks, right? Or is it, no, it's clone Goku. Okay, I'm excited, I think we can tussle with him, we can handle him, we can take this boy down. But yeah, I guess we don't have to worry about too many more tutorials now, it's just gonna be focused all in on making some good progress, which I'm totally fine with, I'm excited for it. All right, this take a little bit long to load up everything, that's fine. So apparently there are some online features of the game that aren't working right now, the, the, the servers are being like destroyed, which is fine, because I don't really matter, like that doesn't matter to me too much right now. 
I'm gonna focus on playing. I'm like, I just, I really just wanna play through the story mode and enjoy it. And I have been so far, it's a lot of fun. It's really interesting, I like all the cutscenes. Come on, get ya. That was pretty good. Let me charge up. I mean, I know I'm not playing super well. Ooh, we got like a little bit of Wolf Fang Fist in there. I'm really excited to play Yamcha because I really like some of Yamcha's moves. I think they're pretty cool. Um, Oh boy, come on, come on. And he also seems to have a very different fighting style than the, you know, Kron and Goku, which is good. But I'm gonna go ahead and like quick change over. Ooh, and that's so awesome because you go right in with like a battle, like an attack, which can be a great start. All right, you know what, you know what, you know what? Oh. Oh, wrong one? Uh, probably. There we go, there we go. Let's do our special move. He was not able to block it. Of course, most people have quick enough reactions that they would have been able to block that. So like, that's sort of the thing that's like, I guess as, 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 as long as we get farther into the story mode, it'll become easier. Ow, you got me, you got me. There you go, I got you too. All right, let's go ahead and, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That was a rush. I don't know if I have to press a certain button there for that to work. Well, let me check out Chain Destructo, Destructo Disc Barrage. I don't really know how to do this. And then like, I guess if I were to charge up my energy enough, maybe I could do that. Here, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm trying to figure this out. And then maybe if I, whoa, that was so cool. Okay then, so definitely I'm gonna be taking a peek at those little lists whenever I can. Cause I wanna go ahead and just try to hit you with more than one. I hit you with one, but I was gonna throw out multiple. So, good stuff there. We defeat another dude, and that means Yamcha is now playable. Very good. Krillin is almost level two as well, so that's going to be very helpful. Let's get going, or continue going, or whatever. <sighs> at least I can move a bit more freely now. Anyway, I think I get the picture. So it was those waves from that thing Bulma made that paralyzed me all of a sudden, huh? I don't exactly like having my power sealed, but I guess our enemies are in the same boat. But I'm sure you'll work it out. No, Yamcha, you're as much a part of this as we are. Fact, we really need more good fighters to join us. Seriously? Yeah, Yamcha. So what do you say? You feel like fighting side by side with us again? Wow, uh, I don't know. I kind of retired a while back. My martial arts skills are gonna be kind of rusty. Oh, looks like all the Kame House uh, trainees are all back together again then. That's pretty cool. Are you sure you even want me to fight? Of course. Huh? Of course we do, Yamcha. I mean, you're already wearing your gi. Of course we want you to. See, even Krillin's gonna be fighting. So the more the merrier. Don't worry, you'll be fine. Even, huh? You really got away with words, Goku. <laughs> Poor Krillin. Okay, yeah, the gang is starting to get back together. It'd be so cool if there was an original Dragon Ball arc, but they'd have to add so many characters, like old, like, you know, Kid Goku, probably like a Team uh, Piccolo. Ally Saved Yamcha is now available in the Team Edit menu. Okay, awesome, that means I can go to Edit My Team, and we can, uh, for the third slot here, add Yamcha, who is already level two, what a great start. And then we also should have more stuff, actually we don't. So I could continue onwards. It looks like more enemies have arrived. Um, when it comes to like this guy, he doesn't have any new moves. So I think I'd rather just go on to these two. Like you can see there's a little question mark. Um, earn experience bonus level one. Ooh, that sounds nice. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this one though, for sure, and see what ends up happening. I don't know how much time I have left to battle today, so I wanna to try to make sure I, you know, spend as much time as I possibly can, because once again, I'm trying to get these episodes out as soon as I can for you guys. It's been a long time since the three of us got together in these uniforms. Indeed. It reminds me of the days when I trained as a martial artist. Actually, now that I think about it, I don't think we've ever trained together, Yamcha. <laughs> so hey, why don't we go a few rounds? This is cool. Well, you're kidding, right? I wouldn't even come close to being a match for you. Not to mention, I'd be giving up fighting. Krillin would be a much better training partner, okay? Hey, now, I've retired from fighting, too. I got a family to think about now. Oh, my gosh. Well, I guess there's nothing I can do about Krillin having a family. Guess robot wives have needs, too. But you know, Yamcha, you're not married, and you don't have a family or anything, right? <laughs> Goku, you gotta get that Yamcha does not want to train with you. You see, about that, I, uh... It's complicated. I have no idea what you're talking about. But if you don't have a real reason to quit fighting, then you should train with me. Goku, uh, are you even hearing the things that are coming out of your mouth? Enough about me already. Let's just focus on the upcoming battle. Let's just... 
Let's think of this fight as us training together, okay? Oh, and please try not to kill me. <laughs> okay, well, we'll do what we can. This is great so far, hearing all these characters interact, because it's like, Goku rarely interacts with Krillin and Yamcha and some of the original Z fighters in Super. It's just there's other stuff that's like way crazier going on. I feel like the sort of more humbler beginnings kind of style to this is really fun. We're literally just going against one Krillin. I think we can handle it. I mean, I don't really know why we're so worried, but man, this area is cool. Oh, this area is so awesome. All right then, so we can do some standing guards. I mean, I guess if the game really wants us to. There we go. But I guess all the tutorial areas, like I'm gonna try to do as many levels as I can so that I don't miss out on any kind of story elements. Um, okay then, so let's try this again. Guard against three, yeah. I mean, we've already done this, but I'll do it one more time just in case there's more, because it's always good to practice. Right, come on over here, dude. Please, please. If it's gonna be like this one like last time, because he's gonna just try to do his triple attack. Right? Hold on, just do it, dude. Just, you know what, fine. I don't need to do this, I already know what to do. Oh man, I really don't like how that tutorial works. But you know what, we're gonna go overboard here. We're gonna go super duper overboard. <laughs> just go Super Saiyan 3 and just destroy you. And hopefully that'll be enough to finish you off. Oh! Oh yes it is, perfect, he didn't hit me once. I blocked it off. <laughs> Battle complete. All right, well, was that worth, the cutscene was longer than the actual battle. And we all got a KO bonus, which means we get the tutorial cleared, and of course, we get, I guess, experience up. So, for getting a KO bonus, which I guess means we knocked them all out, or maybe we refrained ourselves from getting knocked out, we get bonus experience coming in now. If I check out my menu, um, I don't know if there's any way to like figure that out. It doesn't look like it actually tells you anywhere. Anyways, we, like, we have a Krillin down here, it does give you a reward, key charge level one. We'll go against Cell for now. Um, tutorial battle again. What is this one gonna teach us? Fastest in the universe, mastering mid-air movement is crucial. You'll have the upper hand in battle if you can better control your character by performing mid-air dashes, high jumps, and more. Very cool, and we also get a KO bonus and enemy skills. Okay, very, very cool, I'm excited for it. This will probably be our last battle of the day. This is him slowly but surely running out of time. Super Warrior Arc Chapter 4, Evil Exposed, the Red Ribbon Army's Plot. What? Oh, was this supposed to be the final battle in this area? I don't know. <laughs> nice! I think you're getting the hang of it. Hey! You there, my body! You're a pretty darn good fighter, you know that? <sighs> Hope 18 and Marin are okay. They're back at Master Roshi's place. With this many baddies around, could spell trouble. I wouldn't worry. I mean, 18's stronger than you, right? <laughs> yeah. That may be true, but you don't have to put it so bluntly. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> huh? Uh-oh. What'd you find, hey, Goku? Krillin. There's some kind of huge power out there. Feel it? Yeah, I did. It's different. It's not like the clones we've been fighting. I wonder, is it so? Could be. The energy is similar to cells, yes, but it feels a bit smaller, doesn't it? Oh. That's odd. We can sense Cell's energy, but not the person he's fighting with. That he's probably fighting with an android. An opponent with no energy? Hey, do you think maybe Cell's fighting 16? Wait, I've got it. He's an android. You can't sense the energy of an android. We might be able to find a clue or two. I say we check it out. Okay, let's investigate. So if Android 16 is even attacking Cell, then who is Android 16 working with? To be able to do all this and the reason he's back, I mean, obviously there was some kind of like wish made, right? For all these guys to start coming back. Ooh, this is a cool island. I like it, I like it. Reminds me of a Budokai 3 level. Oh, I love that game. I'm gonna be gushing about that one. Because it's all—it's also one of the Dragon Ball games I've played that's sort of a lot like, you know, like a real fighting game like this one is. I knew it, Cell. And his opponent is down. 18! Oh. No! Oh no, please! Spare her! I'll do anything that you say! Who is this? Um, excuse me. What's going on here? What have you done to my wife? Oh my, Krillin is heated up! Oh, ho, ho, look at him go! Whoa, okay, he might be a little bit quicker than that. You gotta be ready for this one. It's gonna be a fight of your life, Krillin. Oh my gosh. This is awesome. So I guess we're gonna be fighting him. Krillin is all he does, so we're gonna take this guy down. I need to play as Yamcha more. I didn't get to play as Yamcha last round. I totally forgot about it because I just wanted to get through that battle real quick. 
Oh my. Oh, he's so intimidating, I love it. Well, if it isn't Goku and his annoying, noseless sidekick. Cell. Holy crap! You are back! That's awesome. To tell the truth, I always did want another go at you. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Because I'm back from the dead and ready to bury you in your wretched offspring. I love his voice. Krill, let me take care of Cell right now. You need to make sure 18's okay. Thanks, Goku. All right. Well. 18! It's no good. She's out cold. Oh my, do you know her? Is she okay? I'm so sorry. She sacrificed herself to save me. <laughs> you monster! Cell, you'll pay for this! <laughs> Look at this spectacle she's putting on. So be it. We'll just have to defeat them all right here, right now. We? Well, I gotta say, I am happy that I'm getting a chance to fight Goku so soon. Sorry, stranger, but I'm gonna need you to look after 18 for me. Cause I'm gonna kick self butt! Oh, Krillin, go Don't get him! make me laugh. Defeat me. As I recall, your power doesn't even compare to that of your better half, 18. Back down, Krillin! This isn't the kind of guy you want to tangle with! What is a husband if he can't protect his wife? Ooh! <laughs> Someone's got Damn right! I don't care how strong you are! Touch my wife, you're going down! Okay, Krillin. Take him out. <laughs> Okay, this is gonna be a bit intense, I'll say that much, but it is Goku, Krillin, and Yamcha versus Cell. Oh my gosh, I'm super excited for this. I'm really excited for this. Oh, Cell is so cool. But uh, Krillin is super fired up, which is great. I'm glad that it seems like he's super and passionate about his wife, but I'm gonna be trying to, uh, I just go ahead and do that. Is it really telling me tutorials still? Is there any way I can like, I mean, I guess I haven't learned mid-air dashes, so I guess now's a good time to learn about them. Okay, so do a mid-air backstab. There we go. And what else we got here? Oh yeah, I remember these jumps. These jumps are weird, but we can do like high jumps if we do it correctly. Oh wow, I forgot the double jump. Okay, finished it. Okay, that was pretty easy stuff. All right then, so I'm gonna quickly change to, like, go ahead and switch. Oh, I gotta wait for the, uh, the bar to fill. All right, so I can switch to Krillin, but I want to switch to Yamcha. I haven't played this Yamcha yet. Well, we'll go ahead and beat you around a little bit, right? Come on, come on, come on. How do I switch to Yamcha? I don't understand. Okay, you know what? Hold on. I know, cool, but how do I play as Yamcha? I don't understand. Okay, now he's moving around really gosh darn quick. I don't know, maybe there's something I'm missing there? I actually don't know how to change to him. Like, I'm doing the thing I do to switch over to, you know, the next character, but it's only switching over to the Yamcha, which doesn't make any sense. All right then, Krillin, finish the suit off. You know what to do. Hit him with your super move and just finish the suit off. You know what to do. I just said that twice. Cell is down. He's super easy because it's still the tutorial stages, but the mission is complete. Okay, so our team is successful. Yamcha did literally nothing, but hey, that's fine. We all got the KO bonus. Krillin leveled up to level two. The tutorial is now cleared for almost 200 zenny there. Cool, cool, cool. I'm really glad with this game so far. It's a lot of fun. Ah, all these damn waves. They're responsible for hindering my true power. Cell, you're through! Oh boy. Get him, Krillin. Soon, you idiots will learn the error of your ways. Oh, you will learn. I have a bad feeling about that. Then, no amount of regret will save you. What is he babbling about? Oh, he used his own move against him? <laughs> That's silly. Poor Krillin can't get any kind of retribution. Damn it. The bug ran off. Can't feel his power either. He's gone. He got away. Are you okay? It's okay. Don't worry. She's just unconscious. But we'd better get her looked at just to be on the safe side. Yeah, I guess so. Hey, thanks so much. 
for standing up for 18. No, it's me who should be thanking you. You're quite strong, the both of you, really. Especially considering you managed to withstand the effects of the waves. Waves? Do you know what's going on? Oh, uh... What happened to 18? Please, I need to know what happened! Yeah, this lady's really weird. Clearly instructed her to stay indoors, if she'd only listened! Very well. I was a researcher, a once proud employee of the Red Ribbon Army. Ah, I see that. Unfortunately, after those waves disabled 18, the army abducted her. As to why she was abducted, I honestly don't know. Yeah? But what about the clones? And Cell coming back? Hey, is the army... Yes. The army is behind everything. I was researching tech that could suppress a fighter's power, allowing us to plant the spirit of another inside. Oh! The technical term is called linking, and it was perfected not days ago. Oh, we've experienced it. Shamefully, when I learned the army planned to use it for total cosmic domination, I became afraid and deserted. While on the run, I met Android 18. We decided to flee together. Then we... we ran into Cell. 18 sacrificed herself to save me. So I guess what you're trying to say is that the Red Ribbon Army is up to their dirty old ways again. And when you tried to quit, they turned on you, tried to hunt you down. Does that sound about right? Yes. Please, you must stop the army. Damn straight we will. Why, we'll tear them to, to, to ribbons. Pun intended. So, you know where their base is, right? We would be very grateful if you showed us the way. I'm sorry, but I wouldn't be able to retrace my steps. I was so caught up in getting away. Ah, uh, great. Oh, by the way, we're gonna go see my friend Bulma. Wanna tag along? You see, the plan is we're gonna have her take a look at 18. All things considered, you'd probably be much safer with us. Actually, I really should be heading home. I'm worried about my family. Don't worry about me. Finding the base, that must be your top priority. Okay. Yeah, whatever you say. All right. Well, I guess she's actually an ally. I wasn't expecting it. I thought she was going to be like, I don't know, different? I don't know. Don't know what I was expecting. She's in the promo art, so I didn't know if she was going to be a good or bad character. Either way, we're on chapter five, map five already. I thought that I was going to be able to get other stuff done there. But I guess we'll worry about it all in the next episode of Dragon Ball Fighters. If you watched this video, make sure you comment Zebra Krillin so I know you've watched at the end that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.